So let's talk about what is the, in your case, you're talking about selling it to funeral homes. I'm sure they, they deal this all the time. Is there an opportunity for one off as a real estate agent or a financial planner or attorney? And they have one customer that could benefit from the service as a one off of opportunity available. What's the cost to provide the service there? Yeah, so there's actually opportunity to work with us with a financial planner or real estate agent in, in two ways. One, if we already have a client in your area, like a funeral home or a hospice or a law firm, what we always like to do is we like to have a local financial planner, local real estate agent, local uh, junk removal service. You know, there's several other services that we can't provide to the family. And what will happen is we go through the checklist with the family, we determine that they need that help. You know, for example, real estate. Hey, it looks like, you know, what are you gonna do with the home? You don't know next steps. It'd be a good time to bring in a real estate agent to consider what those next steps are. So we do have a referral program where we can refer directly to uh, any of those um, agents who would be interested. And then uh, one off clients. So we do a wholesale cost of $200. And then uh, we have had a lot of everything from like assisted living facilities to real estate agents, financial planners who will pay for our service uh, because you know, the number one way, especially for a financial planner, number one way to lose a client is through death, right? And so right. we've had financial planners with, who will pay for our service, the $200 fee. Uh, we'll go in, help the family and then say, okay, this is all of your personal affairs are all wrapped up. We closed Facebook. We, you know, closed all these other accounts. The next step is to meet with your financial planner again. So I'm going to schedule an appointment back with them um, who provided the service. So we're very cognizant of what our clients need uh, for their families, and we just reschedule appointments for them to, to meet with them again. The good news is since the last time you spoke, you and I spoke a month or two ago, and now I haven't known anybody that passed that I could offer the service, but to me, it's a no-brainer because you're doing some of the work that I would have to do for free, but you're doing the work that's gonna be done, and then if you're bringing other partners, it becomes a, a, a no-brainer. So again, for all of us real estate agents, a way to differentiate yourself. Yes, it costs $200. I'd rather spend $200 to service a family in need than 200 postcards that are going to go in the mail and get thrown out and not, uh, and never really want to do any business with me. So that was kind of my think in the process. I hope you liked that video clip. If you want to see more clips from this interview, you can click here. If you see the whole interview, click here.